Sunday, January 6, 3.40 p.m., NBC, the Eagles and the Bears. Bears minus six. Seemed like a really big line to me. Like the biggest favorite between the Cowboys, Texans, and the Ravens all being at home is the Bears. Is that weird? No. No, that defense is amazing. No, it really is. Absolutely amazing. They've played lights out all season long. Trubisky has actually looked pretty good. He he had good numbers against the Vikings yesterday. They're running the football too. Yeah, it's not oh, just Howard it's just, is. They're something just else. not putting it all on Mitchell's back, and that's what's smart. Uh, since we're uh, hey, we're on the Bears now. That's right. Got that's my right. new hat. Absolutely, I brought you a koozie. I went to Chicago last week or two weeks ago, whatever it was. Uh, it had a lot of fun. That is a Bears town right now, boy. Well, it's a Bears town all the time. I mean, it was it, every shop you go time. into. It is. Bears, everything. Bears and Cubs. Yeah. Well, and and Blackhawk, a little bit of Blackhawk stuff, but like, whoo, man, I'm talking people wearing Khalil Mack jerseys just around town, like middle of a work day. That's right. Khalil Mack jerseys everywhere. It's it, that's that's the only jersey I saw. I didn't see Trubisky jerseys anywhere. No. Nah, I saw a Mack jersey. That's not, but I'll tell you this: that's not a knock on Mitchell. That's not a quarterback town. No, that's Listen, a that's there, a defensive town. There are. There are great stories of Mike Dicka like making oh, who was the quarterback uh, that won the Super Bowl, did the Super Bowl shuffle. Anyway. Oh, I don't even know. Yeah. I, how I, ridiculous I, is that? You no, know, I'm just I'm really I'm losing my mind a little bit. Um of him like making him like mop the showers after the games. Like this is <laughs> this is like the like MVP caliber players. Like, no, no. This is we're we're Chicago, baby. We're a defensive, hard nosed football team town. Yeah. We honor running backs. We honor defensive linebackers. That's just what we do. Uh, that's that's 100% the truth. Uh, that Now, on the other side, the Eagles. Nick Foles. I know. <laughs> probably starting the wrong quarterback for most of the season until the last three weeks. I like, really Foles, hate this. Foles the, was 5-1 and one I know. this year. I hate that this is the matchup we get because you know how much I've been on the Bears all year, and I love them. And I made a promise. I'm done betting against Nick Foles. I I said I didn't know who was going to play in the playoffs, but I just said if he gets a every game he started, I bet on him. Every game he started, I won. And I said when he gets in the playoffs, I'm in. I'm all in, all the way through. I'm in. Yeah, because you lost a lot of money on on him last year. Yeah, yeah. Because you bet against him every week. I kept picking against him every week. I picked against him, and I'm done. Look, listen, you fool me about seven times. Eventually, I learn. Okay, I'm I'm a little hard at it. (laughs) It it's might like, take seven. It might take but, losing a lot. But we got to. But listen. I think I'm, <laughs> I think I'm going to go with the Eagles. In the points. Give me that. I think the Bears win. It's a field goal game, and, and they don't cover. That's exactly what – I mean, I'm I'm the same. But we're going the same on three of these four games. Okay. Um, and I'm going to tell you this. I'm taking the under in this one because both of these defenses what is, have been stout. What's our under? 41 even. 41. And I'm going under that bad boy. I think we're going – this is going to be the 17-13 game. Okay. Nobody's okay. hitting 20 in this one. That's that's my call. I don't know, man. I'm looking at defensive touchdowns. Like, I, Trubisky can and throw I, it to the wrong team. Foles can throw it to the wrong team. Like, Yeah, but can the Special teams turn turnover. You know, I mean, no, the, like no, the Bears like, can. The Bears can. But if Foles – man, I don't know. I'm just done. Look, if I was going to go over, I'd be betting the Bears. I'm just – that's what I would be doing. But I've done this too much to know that I can't bet against Foles. I just can't. I've, I've done it too often and lost. I do like the Eagles plus the six. But, man, 41 is so low. That's a small number, man. Because, I mean, a, a 24 to, what, 17? Dude, I mean, you only have to get to 24. 24 to 17 is 41. Yeah. So like, I mean, I'm you get. I mean, twenty-two twenty is it? I'm gonna I'm gonna roll the over on it. I think I'm going to we'll regret go this. That way. Um, I'm going over in three of these games. I know I'm gonna regret it, but the uh, one what what is a big cat always says? Life's too short to bet the under, man. I know, I know. The the one guy that scares me on the Eagles, other than Foles and God, is is a. Uh, is the same guy that scared me last year when they went on their runs, Fletcher Cox. 
I think Fletcher Cox has potential to wreck games. Yeah. And he's done it. He's done it a lot. And last year he did it in four playoff games and won a Super Bowl. He didn't yeah. he didn't get the MVP and he, he deserved it. He didn't get the credit because he plugs up holes and he takes two to three guys to take him and other guys get to go free. But that guy has potential to wreck games. You uh you also took the over in every game but this one. Yeah. I took the under in I, the Cowboys Seahawks. I think the you scoring the will go down some. The average over under this year was in the fifties. Yeah. And and more went over than under. In the playoffs, I know that's gonna go down, but I don't think it's gonna go down 10, 15 points. No, I think you're that's, right. That's that's why. Is I think all of those teams that that we saw earlier, if every one of those games ends up 24-25, 24-28. 23-27. If every one of them end up that, it will not shock me. If we get a 13-17 ball game out of any of them but the but the last one, I'll be surprised. I think everybody's scoring in the 20s. All right, so I'm, I'm going over the 41. You're going under the 41. Yes, yeah, the one I'm going under. We both have the Eagles plus six, but we both think that the Bears will win. Yes. Well, I really want the Bears to win. I'm not going to bet money line on the Eagles just because I'll be sad if it happens. Yeah. I'll be sad if it happens. But, but I mean, you got a six-point cushion here. You should be okay. fine. I think we're going to see close games out of all of these. I don't see any routes at all. Yeah, I think I think. I think every one right. of them is going to be a field goal game. I think you're probably right. 